So you want to delete your Google My Business page. Well, let me just make it clear, first of all, that that's the most common request I receive on a daily basis at this time. But I'm going to help you do that. Gone in 60 seconds will be your location or your page. But I'm first of all going to just clarify what is it you mean when you say you want to delete Google My Business page. Thanks for joining me. I'm Zane from Zanet Design. So I help businesses like yours grow on the internet. And one of the things that uh, as part of growing on the internet is to make sure that your SEO, your local business, and all your references are put together in a way that's going to attract customers. But there are times when things go wrong, and that's probably why you're here. That You've perhaps written several things about your company, and now you've realized you just want to start again with your Google My Business location. Maybe you've got a few things wrong. Maybe you've had some bad reviews and you're just trying to make amends. Well, we're going to look at all the various things as to why you may want to delete your Google My Business location. But just to be clear, there are three things that you may be meaning when you say you want to delete your Google My Business page. We're going to look at all three things in this video. So we're going to presume it's the actual, uh, when we say page, we mean the location. So here I've got some locations on my Google My Business. The one I'm going to delete is Fred's Fish and Chips. And the simple way to do this is to click there and then under Actions, then to go to either Permanently Closed, if I think I might want to reinstate it in the future, or Remove Location. I'm going to click Remove Location. And then it says if you remove these locations from your account, then obviously all these things take place. It can't be recovered. If a business is closed, though, then you should mark it as permanently closed before removing it. If you don't want to remove a location, you can transfer ownership. Well, I do want to get rid of it, so I'm going to remove. And then you'll see that that is now going through the system. One location removed, and that's it. That's how you delete Google My Business business page. Now, it may be that that's not what you mean. And I'm going to cover this second area where you might just be referring to the page that's on the website itself. Now, you'll notice if you go to website when you log into your Google My Business, and here you'll see you've got your website page. So I'm going to go view site, and I'll open that in a new link as well. So you might be referring to this. This is your kind of business website that's produced. And this is produced based on the posts that you upload. So you might be referring to, when you say Google My Business page, that you're referring to, I actually don't want this one to show. And that's easy enough as well. If we just go into Read More, and this is like a page in itself. It's actually a post, but on here you can report it if it was someone else's and you weren't happy with what they were writing about you. But in this case, uh, this is just a case of it's been uh, used uh, as a post. And the way to deal with this is to really go back to your posts. So if you click into posts on your Google My Business dashboard, and here is all the posts that you've written. So it's the same things, but just been displayed as the way you wrote them. And if you wanted to delete it, then it's just simply a case of clicking on here, and you've got the option of editing it if you want to change it, or you can delete it. So if you mean delete Google My Business page because you want to remove one of these pages, then that's uh, how you go about it. There's the third thing you could mean when you say delete Google My Business page, and it could be just a case of these like pages on the website too. So how do you delete the About Us? Well, you can't really. What you have to do is just obviously blank down the information. This information here is taken from the information that you enter when you go into uh, your sections here. So like info is uh, you can write uh, information about your company. Uh, so you fill it out here. Uh, and that, in effect, makes your um, your about page. So a lot of the, the things that you enter in here make the pages that are occurring here. So testimonials, obviously, are the testimonials. Uh, gallery will be the photos that you've entered. So there are three types of meanings of delete Google My Business page. Identify which one it is that you want to delete. And then hopefully one of those three has covered it for you in our tutorial. Thanks, and here are two videos that have been chosen specially for you.